Hello guys, today I'm gonna show you guys how to use Logic Pro X. As you can see on the screen here, I have uh, the Logic Pro X open. And let's say you wanna start creating your own music, start recording your own songs, then uh, you can use Logic Pro. And there are many, many, many that uh, uh, software that you can use to create your own songs to record your own songs but me personally i choose logic pro x there are a lot of features in it there is a, there are a lot of things you could you could do uh, musically and i'll show you how to add tracks and let's say if you want to create a song first you have to decide the tempo of the song that you want to you want to record and in order for you to change the uh, the tempo it uh, to set your tempo it is very easy as you, can, as you can see in the top screen here, we have a BPM. So for those who don't know, BPM is uh, the tempo of the song in which you want to record. So you, you can just double click on it and you just, uh, let's say, enter your number that you want. Let's say if you want the tempo to be at uh, 80 or if you want it to be at 90, you just enter it and then hit enter. So now it is set to... Uh, BPM of 80 or the tempo is being changed to 80 and let's say if you want to add a track so if you want to add a track you could uh, definitely go here you see the plus sign here you click on it and then it's gonna ask you do you want to add a software instrument track or do you want to add an audio track or external MIDI or guitar or bass or drummer so you want to click on it depending on, on what you want to do you can just add the software instrument track so you hit create then it's gonna give you a new track and then you can select on the sounds that you want to use in that track if it's a piano or if it's let's say an orchestra or if you want to use uh, the drum kit so, and you can just set up your tracks and from there whichever sound you you select and you will be able to play it and record and let's say you finish uh, selecting your tracks and you want to record all you have to do is you hit the R the letter R on the keyboard here then it's gonna stop recording so you can just play anything you want to play and then it will record it and once you finish recording it then you can hit stop which is you can just hit the space bar then it will stop recording Okay guys, today this is all I wanted to show you in Logic Pro X, how to set up your tempo, uh, your tempo of the song that you want to record, and how to add tracks, and how to record. If you have any questions about uh, Logic Pro, just leave them in the comments below, and I'll make sure to get back and answer all your questions. Okay guys, have fun, and uh, no matter what software you're using, uh, the basics are the same, they're all the same. Uh, just if you have any questions once again, just add them in the comments and I'll get back to you to show you uh, to answer your questions